parkour challenge complete yeah i am i am the bestest somewhere in here i had a pressure plate nice we'll pop that on there and we'll come through so i believe i'm still looking for my sleeping pills um sleeping pills of course are very bad for you um if you if you have sleeping issues ah oh, jesus what is that it where am i supposed to get the second pressure plate from huh huh um can i go over the top I don't know, I've not really been ma given anything to break blocks with, so I don't I don't think that's really what I'm supposed to be doing. All this string is nice though. Am I allowed to make wool and go over the top? I uh, that feels a bit cheaty. Um, uh, you can only craft pressure plates and you can place them on bedrock. Uh, place ladders anywhere. Have fun. Yeah, there's the, there's no there's no rules here saying I can't break stuff, but I don't know. That's just kind of golden rule of um, Minecraft adventure maps, right? You don't. Let's try putting that in there and see if that's open. No, look. So where am I supposed to get two bits of stone from? There must be two bits of um, smooth stone to make a pressure plate. Because I got that first one from uh, from the first chat, like way back at the beginning. Do you guys remember way back at the beginning now? I do. Just about. Um, right, we're not supposed to put that to open the door. So it probably means the door's got nothing going on behind it. It's normal stairs. Is there, another, is there a chest somewhere I'm missing? I mean, here's the craft bench. Ah, I was supposed to use these to craft a wooden pressure plate, right? Then how am I supposed to get over there? Um, it probably is Parkour Challenge Central, right? I don't like this. <laughs> I, I'm not going to cheat. I'm just going to redistribute a block. That's not cheating, right? Surely. <laughs> okay, we've got a pressure plate. Um, yeah, one of the main rules of all these things is have fun. So th this is me having fun. There we go. All right, what, what have we got? We got with another broken disc. What are we supposed to do with the broken disc? Okay, well, let's... Oh. Oh, I'm stuck. How am I stuck? Why am I stuck? It's not very good. But what? Uh... No, actually, what am I doing here? Like, there's no... I've got another disc, but I've not got a way of getting out. Let's kill all these strings so I can see what's going on. Well, no, I've actually not got a way out. Um, well, there goes my sword. I hope I don't need it for anything else. Ah, ah. Oh, um, I think I was supposed to throw an item on that pressure plate out there. I mean, that's the only reason I could think they would give us a wooden. All right, let's let's definitely not cheat. Oh yeah, that was definitely not cheating, right? Um, let's, let's just have a quick look around. I mean, it's not something silly like put some string there and interact with the string. No, um, there is a different piece of wood here. Does that mean anything? Let's find out. No. Oh wow, it's bright out there. Let's put that back, shall we? <laughs> it's supposed to be moody in here. Uh, 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 I'm just going to accept that that's probably it. <laughs> I mean, what what else could, could actually be going on here, right? Um, okay, so now we go around and try this music disc and everything. Like that. Sweet. Uh, and what, what are we supposed to be doing here? Oh, we're listening to creepy music. Oh. So that static, I believe, actually says something in um, any sort of waveform reader that you put put it in. Um, I, I have no idea what it reads. Oh, 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 I've been teleported to a chapel. Why is there a chapel in my house? Why is there a chapel in my house? What's been going on here? Who are, I say, what have we got in this one? We've got a load of religious novels. Otherwise known as Bibles. Oh, it could be the Quran. Have I said that right? Quran. Yeah. Uh, I, I, unfortunately, because I live in England, that's the only 
religious books I know of. Um, which is a bit, a bit rubbish if, I, if I'm going to say that so myself. I don't know what the Buddhists read. I don't know, I don't know what anyone other than um, Muslims and, and Christians read. Which is, yeah, a bit rubbish. I should have uh, narrowed that down. Well, I've picked up all the religious novels. I'm not sure why. There's a button there. I don't, I'm not sure if I want to press that. Uh, more, more chests. Oh look, here we go. Priest note. All right, we got we got to warm up here into my best West Country accent before I start reading, so that I'm I'm already there and talking about it when I'm in there. Right. Date six six oh zero six. Ooh, the date of the devil. Today's sermon Genesis. Oh, that's a rubbish note. Oh, well, at least I know now know that I'm in a Christian place. As if all these like crosses on the wall hadn't already told me that. Um, where has he put the torch back? Oh, he's sunken it, sunken it back one, or made it sink back one. I don't know. All right, so there's a, bu there's a bell up there. I don't have anything to ring the bell. Uh, what have we got? Somewhere for a pressure plate? That's nice, but I reckon that's after whatever this open space here is for. Hello. Uh, oh, message board. Uh, monastery is locked until all books are returned. Priest John, 59 books are missing. I've only got 37. Book return. I'm going to wait until I found all the books so we know what I'm doing. 59, but was that 59? Let's let's get that number straight. 59 books are missing. Uh, today's cold. Wednesday's cold. Thursday's cold. So we are currently on Tuesday. Oh no, it says Tuesday's cold. Oh damn it! What day is it today? Event board. Monday sermon. Adam and Eve. Tuesday sermon. Gen well, look, look, I got it right. Today's today's code is Tuesday. Uh, we, if in case you're wondering, I got the priest notes from there. Okay, right. We don't we don't care about the rest. So, how do I put this code in? Two, three, four, five. Uh, no. Ah, uh, I should take a photo, uh, a screenshot of that, right? Um, so where do we put the code in? There must be somewhere to put a code in. Um, I don't know. Let's go and have a look around. I, I literally just cannot see. Is, is there anything, anything up there to put a code in? No, that's a dispenser. Should we try? Yeah, there's a pressure plate in there. Okay, well that's what that's about. Oh, there's a. Well, that's powered. I wonder what that's about. All right. Anyway, <laughs> I should uh, go around look for some more books. I mean, where where would we where would books be hidden? Anything in here? No. Can't put anything in there. Oh look, here's a, here's a hidden thing. We're at 43. Uh, press the button. Anything happen when I press the button? No. No, there's just a chest there. I reckon we've got one more chest of books to find. Um, I'm pretty sure I did all six here. Uh, I'm just going to double check there. Better than that, I did all eight. Yeah, okay. Is there a chest up there anywhere? I don't see one. Hmm. Is that a secret hidden chest? On? Do you see that? How do I get to that without break? Oh, excuse me, without breaking stuff. Can I kind of reach through here? Is that a oh, look, there we go. 54. It's not 59 that I'm looking for. That's an anvil. Is that any good? No. So there's one more chest somewhere. I was a chest of books. Where would I be hiding it? Uh, I don't know. That that spot that I just spotted would be the place I hide it. Hit it. Hide it. English, Steve. English. Um, are there any in there? No, because this is the bit we need to get. So where do we put the code? This this is still. Oh, ow. This is still number one priority. We have we know where we're supposed to put a code. Fifty nine books. It's fifty four. We need. We just need another five books. Just need another five books. Uh, I, how do we get back there? How do I get back there? Are there, are there books missing from here? Did it, he didn't put books? Ah ha! Ah ha ha ha! Ah ha! Solved it. Boom. Job done. Right. Let's pop that in there. Okay. How am I going to remember this code? You know what? I'm going to take a moment. Um, I've got a pencil on my desk somewhere. We're just going to write this down over here. Oh. No, if we press the right buttons, I'm just going to write this down over here. Three, two, six, five, four, one. Okay, right. 
right with the code in hand or on the desk as it uh, happens to be we're going to come along and get this because everything's fed out of it nice yeah all right and then we're going to go pop this pressure plate here run through the door Woo! done it okay uh one two three oh this is where the code goes should we should we get some more light going okay welcome to the code room uh huh okay so we have three wait for the button to pop back out two wait for the button to pop back out six five four one oh I used all of them okay so it must be a load of uh, and gates back there I think I know how that works I've, I've made a few of those Does this button oh oh there's a T flip flop back there nice uh, that's pretty that's pretty tasty actually uh right so where are we are in the catacombs i've got a bottle of water it's mine ah, what have we got in the furnaces anything of any note no okay so we got a door that we can't go through we got some circle stone does that do anything no i mean we're not supposed to do that anyway the torches are not for opening doors uh oh look at all those chests lovely okay this is the bit that i saw from over there more circle stone and another locked door this can't go anywhere surely um yeah it must end like here because there's another room the other side of that all right well let's carry is, is this an actual maze are we in some serious catacombs uh i don't know oh look here's, here's somewhere to go it's dark to put on a torch um yeah this is what we're looking for let's go search all these chests out hmm do you think i'm supposed to still have my sword here uh, I think this is a possibility that I am supposed to still have my sword here. But that's all right. We'll just um, knock this down with an, a, a redstone torch. The, you know that well-known item for breaking cobwebs. Uh, I can presume I, I'm only using it like like you would with a normal torch in a room full of cobwebs. You just kind of wave it around and watch it all like shrivel up. I don't know if anyone's set fire to cobweb before, but it doesn't catch fire. It's like hair. It, go, it, it kind of like bubbles up. Uh, proteins, hey, weird things. Uh, is, this, is this really making me stay here? Okay, there's nothing in there, nothing in there. Books, more books. Yay, and a bit of stone. Okay, so I guess we're looking for a second bit of stone somewhere to make a pressure plate. Anything behind here? No. Just being a vandal and breaking everything. We. Do you think the rotten flesh is supposed to still be in my inventory? I don't think so. Do you reckon we can find a jukebox somewhere to put this Maholi somewhere? Somewhere, somewhere. I don't know, maybe. Uh, we've got another cross, religious paraphernalia. Why is there a chapel here? Uh, is this going to turn out to be some sort of like uh, the Crusaders have uh, cursed Andrew Blake here to um, be awake forever because he's got part of a soul in him that came from the Crusades, maybe? Yeah, who knows? I don't know. I'm just picking stuff up. All right, let's um, wander on out this door. I, so we picked up a pressure plate. Uh, I just kind of glazed over that because I was too busy telling my crusade story but we've got a pressure plate and we've got some um, got some bedrock that's the pressure plate I just got the stuff out of that's alright All right. is there anything other than this one door to put stuff in no okay and all these other doors are locked it's a shame it's a shame but there we go let's see if there's anything up here no is there anything in this this middle bit here no uh, anything in here no alright okay so with all that checked let's go through the door well, this is a lovely place, isn't it? Look at this. It's nice. Um, could have used with some light instead of it, but then I suppose he is going for like moody map, um, which is nice. Okay, so we've got another door we can't get through, another door we can't get through, and another door we can't get through. So let's go around the outside corridor. Um, yeah. I mean, what, what's the worst that could happen, eh? Oh, we could come up against a set of iron bars. All right, let's try around the other way. Boing, 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 boing. Oh, obviously, bunny hopping is the way to go. It's another locked thing. What? Say so what? All right, so I can only assume that there's some a hidden chest or something, because I can't go back. I can't go back. So there must be a hidden chest somewhere. Right? Surely. Um. <laughs> well, I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll have a search round, we'll check all the corners. Um, I'm a little bit confused. If I can't go back anywhere, then I'm in some serious trouble. Anything under the water? I can't really see. Can you guys see? 
Uh, uh. I don't know. I don't know. Right. I think I'm actually going to call this episode here. I would say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure. I'm going to take a small break and let my brain uh, cool down a little bit because it's a hot day and well. Uh, and hopefully, while I was thinking, I will think about what actually needs to be done and then i'll be back in a second this may not actually be an episode break if it is bye <laughs>